Hey, it's Sam from Dan Talk, Real Talk, Let's Talk. So it is Saturday, and I promised you on Saturday we were going to talk about something dirty, because I know you guys like that, right? And so do I. So here we go. I don't think Saturday sex has to be like once a week, like it used to be in the 50s, where you have dinner and you have a bath and then you have sex. No, no, no. Tonight we're going to take it to a whole new level. We're going to try something different. So uh, I've had a lot of comments about adversity towards a three-way, adversity towards anal. So tonight, what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our original series on how to put your finger up someone's ass so that you can get used to your cock going in someone's ass and it's a pleasurable experience for both of you we've talked about being circumcised being non-circumcised what the challenges can be so we're going to start from today and we're going to try it again after everyone's all cleaned up and you can even do it together shower together we don't we talk about this every day but here we go I always suggest olive oil because olive oil is something natural. Most people have oil at home if it's cooking or if you don't have olive oil. But use something. You don't need to buy expensive lubricants and you don't need to buy something scented or something that's going to affect your taste. Put some on your fingers. Use one finger to start. If you're putting it up, well, if you're putting it up her ass, use two. If you're putting it up his ass, use one to start. Maybe not that one, but use one to start. And then you progress to two. The reason is you need to get that comfort zone. Open that sphincter a little bit more. Let the person feel comfortable so that when they slip their cock in there and or a tool or whatever, you know, there's a lot of things that we have available to us to use, but you need to feel comfortable because it's going to be tight. I like tight. That's why I like it from, I like anal sex. I like it from the back. I don't mind tight at all. Tight gives you that pounding, pounding, pounding feeling that can really turn you on. That's what you want. When, you know, even doggy style, when you're doing a doggy style and you're getting it hard, it's giving you the ability to feel it, to feel the pounding. He's grabbing your breasts as they're hanging there. He's pounding you from the back, whatever it is. But tonight we're going to focus on getting your cock into that ass one way or another. So start easy, work it up. And then, as we talked about before, lube up the tip of your cock, put it in there and gently push it and then gently push it a little bit more and then gently push a little bit more and then ask the, your partner, him or her, is it feeling okay? Once they say yes, don't gently anymore, just go. You know why? It's like ripping off a bandage. Now, once you're in like this much, the rest of it is, is gonna be okay and it's going to be that pleasure, pain sensation that makes them say, oh my God, that hurts, but I love it. Everyone wants to feel that orgasmic come. Everyone wants to feel that, yeah, this is what I want to do again. When we talk about Saturday sex every single week going forward, we're going to talk about something that stretches your uh, comfort zone and your ass or whatever part of the body we're talking about. Diane from Diane Talk, Real Talk, Wheel Talk. Tomorrow we're talking about trans sex by request. I have uh, some very interesting stuff to talk about with you and I look forward to it. I'll see you later. Bye.